Hello guys, welcome to another video on Healthy Talky YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to learn about tips on how to lower high blood pressure. Before we get started with the video, check the link in the description box below to discover the secret formula we recommend if you want to be free from high blood pressure. Quick advice, make sure you watch this video to the end to get the most value from it. Let's start with today's video without wasting too much time. If you want to know how to lower high blood pressure, we might want to start by talking about what causes it in the first place. Well, the truth is that there are a lot of things that can cause it, like a bad diet, not getting enough exercise, stress, and high blood pressure. If you don't treat high blood pressure, it can lead to other, more serious conditions, like a heart attack or stroke. If you know what causes high blood pressure, you can avoid the risks that come with it. High blood pressure can be helped a lot by changing your diet and being careful about what you eat and drink. Cholesterol is one of the main things that lead to high blood pressure. If you compare someone with a healthy diet to someone with high cholesterol, you can almost be sure that the person with high cholesterol will have higher blood pressure. Cholesterol makes fat build up on the walls of the arteries. Over time, these fats harden into plaque, which makes the arteries and blood vessels smaller and smaller. Your body still needs to pump the same amount of blood through these blood vessels, which is what causes high blood pressure. Getting less sugar in your diet is another great way to bring down high blood pressure. We all love sweets and desserts, but again, cutting back on sugar can really help lower high blood pressure. When you eat a lot of sugar or foods that are high in sugar, your blood gets thicker because of the glucose. If your blood is thicker than it should be, it makes it harder for it to flow through your body, which leads to high blood pressure. Another good way to help lower high blood pressure is to do less of the other things that have been shown to cause it. Nicotine, which is found in cigarettes and other tobacco products, is one of these. It has also been shown that drinking too much alcohol raises the risk, so cutting back on alcohol will help lower your blood pressure, as will cutting back on how much caffeine you eat. Exercise has also been shown to help a lot with lowering high blood pressure, but you should always talk to your doctor or a medical professional before starting a hard exercise program since the wrong kind of exercise could make your symptoms worse. Weight lifting shouldn't be done because it can put a lot of stress on the heart. Cardiovascular workouts that are very hard are also not good for people with high blood pressure because they raise your blood pressure a lot. The best way is to work out moderately. Over time, this will lower your cholesterol, your weight, and your blood pressure. Yoga and other slow motion exercises are especially good for lowering high blood pressure because they are good for the heart. Always do some warm up and cool down exercises before and after your main workout. This keeps your blood pressure from jumping up and down in dangerous ways. By following these simple tips on what to eat and how to exercise, you will be well on your way to getting your blood pressure into a more normal range. You will also be able to prevent future high blood pressure. If you have tried all these tips and still suffering from high blood pressure, then check out the secret formula we recommend. This is an all-natural supplement that you can use to achieve your desired results and be free. It is easy to take, very effective, and highly recommended. Learn more about our secret formula from the link below this video in the description box and find out how it can help you to get rid of high blood pressure. Thanks for watching this video and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. The videos on your screen right now are also educative and informative, so make sure you watch them too. Leave a healthy life, stay strong.